Hello, good morning. I am here to take your temperature. They do like 50% of the technic work. They take vitals like temperature. They record messages uh, that give us a feedback in terms of uh, clinical judgments. Meet Akazuba, Ikizere, and Gabo. These are no ordinary healthcare workers. They report for duty at the Kanyinya COVID-19 treatment facility, a short distance from Wanda's capital, Kigali. The African nation has deployed these robots in a bid to minimize contact between patients infected with the coronavirus and doctors and nurses. They help us to decrease or reduce the risk of transmission from patients to staff. Let's say before we had them, would visit between two to three or four times a day uh, per patient. But now at least uh, we we now up to two times a day. So that tells you how helpful they are and what impact they have made in terms of reducing the number of visits to the patient. The sleek white robots with their big bright blue eyes carry out simple tasks like take temperatures, monitor patients, take readings of vitals, and deliver video messages and feedback between doctors and patients. Officials said the bots will be programmed to carry out additional tasks as well. If you program them, they can take a tray to, to a patient uh, with the products you want to bring to the patients, they can bring them. Uh, but for now, we are using them for those, uh, those tasks. The robots were donated by the United Nations Development Program. Rwanda already uses drones to deliver blood and enforce restrictions designed to slow the spread of the coronavirus. There are two more robots at the country's other COVID-19 treatment center, Yamata in southeast Kigali. 